What's good with y'all, man? So, uh, listen, we're in a time and age today where a lot of you guys are understanding that, yo, when it comes to getting women, when it comes to maximizing your potential, you have to go literally, literally above and beyond in, in damn near every category. Right? I know you. a lot of you guys are sick and tired of having to feel like you need to prove something to these women. I'm going to tell you something. You don't. Guys, the only the only reason, right, the only person that you are in competition with is that person that you see when you look in the mirror. That's that's first and foremost, right? You ain't got nothing to prove to, you know, any other man. You ain't got nothing to prove to the women. There's all kinds of different routes and ways you can go about getting a woman to want you, right? Enticing a woman to want to be with you. But there's only one best way, right? We all know the superficial guys. If you want to go by looks, money, status, that's how you finna attract. You're going to attract women. Best believe that. But I hope you're prepared to weed out the ones that's not really for you or the ones that's not going to bring nothing of value to you when the time comes, when it's necessary. Because you got to be ready to cut when you got to cut. And that's that's the realest talk I can give you. Now, it's all cool. Hey, it's fine and dandy. If y'all just want to be out here slinging, hey, that's cool. That's cool. If any guy just wants to be out here, I don't know. Whatever stage you at in your you want to pump and dump, hey, you just want to live lavishly, you want to be the next Hugh Hefner out here, you just want to pimp to the day you die. That's fine, bro. Do what you do. But I'm going to tell you, you attracting women for those kind of reasons, just know what they are for. That's all I'm going to tell you. That's the game. That's free game right there. You attract them for, for the superficialness, expect that. Don't be out here trying to turn no hoe into a housewife. All right, those are the situations I cannot stand because you knew you picked her up off the streets and you knew where she belonged and you knew it was only a matter of time until you had to drop her right back off there. So don't come to me with the issues, right? If you attract women from your looks, money, and status, especially for the money and status, know exactly why they with you. Know why they are with you. Do not be stupid. Don't get played. You cannot be foolish out here going by that. These beta males out here, you want to, okay, you want to splurge and spend your money on these chicks. You want to burn it for her, right? Get all these nice designer clothes for her and stuff. All right, well, that's the only reason she's staying with you. She's not legit staying with you because you done made her want you for real. She wants your money or she wants your status, right? The best way to get women to want you guys is to literally be yourself. Now, what do I mean by this? Some of you guys are like, oh, I can do that. I've been doing, I, I'm already, I'm doing that right now. They ain't coming though. You gotta be yourself, but you gotta be the best version of yourself. You still gotta put in the work. But what kind of work are you putting in? You putting in work in the gym? You need to be doing that. You need to be making yourself the best possible option you can be. But it cannot be for these women. I told y'all, you're not out here to impress anybody. Who is your competition? Who is your only competition? Yourself. You shouldn't be looking up to any of these foolish ass celebrities out here that just, you know, do a bunch of stupid shit for money. And, and they just live in the way. Hey, that's their life. That's not your life, though. I'm going to just keep it real with you. I'm keeping it a buck. Right? You want to live life for yourself. Women respect a man that's on his grind. Women respect a man that knows what he wants, right? And he goes after it. If you know you need to get your ass in the gym, then you need to get your ass in the gym. If you know you got to put in more work, right, to get where you want to be at career wise, uh, financially, etc., the list goes on, you need to put in the work. Women respect that. That's the best way you want to have a woman wanting you. You want a woman to want you for the qualities that you are bringing to the table. What do you bring to the table then, man? That's a question geared at y'all. What do you really bring to the table? Because women ain't just finna try to stay with you just because if you splurging and, and flashing money in front of their face, 
they're gonna assume okay that's what he got that's his value monetary so hence what the hell you think they finna do can i have a birkin can i have this prada bag can i have this can i have that i'm asleep with your friend behind your back that's what's finna happen to you that's what's because all you is is a meal plan right you can't lead with that with them the best way to get women to want you is for you to be genuinely you you're not showing up presenting your clout you're not showing up presenting yourself as hey listen i have this i have this i i do this i do that don't be one of these super braggart guys these boastful guys whenever i'm introducing myself to a girl i never mention my status i never mention any of that stuff i don't want your instagram i don't want you to look at mine right because if you if, if if i'm in my shoes i'm like okay you see what i am i'm just gonna assume you want me for that reason i'm not gonna assume anything is genuine is coming out of this and i'm gonna tell you something even if you don't got a status like that even if you ain't got it like that period you want to carry yourself like that you want to be this kind of reserved person as far as like hey what i got what i do is not on the table for discussion right now right we just meeting up we ain't even got the square b we still we, we ain't even met a yet i'm still testing you out i don't know what you do i don't know what you're capable of right so you shouldn't be ready to divulge everything you got from the get-go now you're trying to you're trying to sell yourself like verbally you want to sell yourself on hey he's a mysterious guy he's fit right he's dressed nice he looks clean he takes care of himself all these things are implied. I, you sell yourself on implied things. You don't sell yourself. I don't need to brag and sell myself and tell her, I got this, I got that, I got this, I got that. Let it come out naturally. If you're a high value man, you're going to carry yourself that way unintentionally. It's just going to happen. They're going to feel that energy off of you. Okay, this is why I want this guy. He's a man of action. He's on his purpose. If you're looking at yourself right now and you know clear cut given, you're not the best version of yourself right now or on your way to be that, man, put in the work. Click the link in my description. If you need some help, you can click the link in my description. If you just want a, another boost, right? You want to reach the next plateau, the next level, you can still click the link in the description. If you're not putting in work, you can't expect to attract uh these women out here the best way you can because the best way you can is to focus on you and that's the truth you be you by being the best version of you you be you by focusing on you and letting these women flock to you now you like hey well let's see who's finna provide uh the best compatibility for me right that means you are the ticket holder i got a ride right here it's just newly established and we still working on some more perks. So the ride's gonna get even more excited, baby. Now, who do I wanna give this ticket to? You feel like Willy Wonka in that bitch. I got the golden ticket. Who the hell won? You are picking and choosing, but that's only after you put in the work. That's only after you know, hey, you know exactly what you want. You gotta be a man on a mission, a man with a damn plan. Women respect the hell out of that. Are there going to be superficial women out there? Yeah. And guess what? You got to level up regardless, mentally, physically, emotionally, what, every way, every which way to be able to discern which ones you need to weed out and cut out because they ain't going to be right for you. They going to lower your expectations, right? Your dream might dwindle because they you keeping them around you. You might want to move smart. Not even might. You need to, Right? That's the best way to attract them, though. You be the person, guys. Your test is when you have what you desire. That's when you have all these options exposed to you. A woman's test is when she's with a man that ain't really got much, right? And she's still being faithful. Watch out for those. Right, these little superficial chicks that come along, they're gonna come and best believe they're gonna come along. You still attracting them though, it is what it is. Hey, but those can still get separated. All right, yeah, you okay, had a little nice fling with you, bye bye. All right, cool, yeah, deuces.
as soon as they start rambling and talking about something, ah, nah, don't even hear it. You already know what to do with those, right? Be the best version of yourself. Like, guys, you don't lose this way. I, I really don't understand why most guys don't want to hear no motivation video. They want to hear all these videos about how to get girls, how to how to slint, you know, how to how to do all these things and you know manipulate women and do all this stuff. But you don't want to get motivated to be the best version of yourself. You don't want to get motivated to level up. You don't really want to attain this better version of yourself. You don't want to become this man that you know you will be in the future or can be. That's the best way to do it. No lies told.